Why is it so much lace? We come in peace. <laughs> Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by me. I purchased this unit with my own coin a while ago. It is also Slip and Slay, and today we got our wine in a can. Okay, Stella Rosa. <laughs> Thank you, Stella Black. Stella Black, okay, like me. Let's open the can up real quick. Hold up, my, my nails, my nails. Let's get a little commotion for the can. <laughs> Let me not waste it on my white shirt. Ooh, that's good, that's good. I feel like it tastes even better in the can. Babe got these for me, so thank you, I appreciate it. Anyway, for today's video, we are styling up this unit right here. This is an oldie made new by Outre, and for all my budget baddies, this joint is under $30. Listen, it don't matter what your budget is, okay? Think big. You need to be thinking big, bitch. <laughs> Okay, so we are giving the looks on our budget today and I'm here for it. But as always, before we get into all that, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this unit is from Outre. It is the Annie Bob. This unit dropped, um, well, it was a revamp from the Annie Bob from like five, six years ago. And then they dropped it again about a year or two ago. I got it when it dropped then, but I just did not review it. It's been sitting on my shelf since then. So I decided to go ahead and bust her out now for a cute little simple look for the weekend. And I'm excited to try her. Now, right out the pack, she's giving me pressed out braiding hair. Connect a lot. I'm not always a fan of that, especially if, you know, it gets kind of tangled. Pretty sure when this dropped a couple years ago, people were know kind of hype about it so I want to see if the hype is still there now okay now that I'm trying her I'm here now Let, let's see <laughs> <laughs> now the cap construction is pretty basic. It comes with the center part, two combs on the side, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. Now I'm gonna go ahead and tip my lace using my Maybelline Fit Me 360 Mocha Powder. Uh, I'm gonna put that all around the hairline because the lace is giving like a yellow tint and clearly your girl got some melanin, okay? Now depending on where you buy this wig from, this is like a $20 wig. I will have my Amazon link down below so if you wanna shop there, you can, but you can buy it from wherever you wanna buy it from. I'm just telling you guys what I'm listing down below. I did take off the adjustable straps in the back because it looks a little small. Why is it so much lace? We come in peace. <laughs> like Utre, you ain't have to waste this lace like this. Utre, are you hoarding lace? I'm gonna cut that right on off like that. All right, let me take some of this hair out of this parting space because it's real, ooh, it's real tight. All right, so let me cut a V in here in the front of my parting space. Okay, this is looking real janky. <laughs> it's kind of bumpy up in here. What's going on? Okay, so I'm gonna use my got to be spiking gel. We're gonna put it right here in the front on both sides of that V. We're gonna lift that up right there and lift that up right there. Then we're gonna lay it back down. Okay, let me push it to the front like this. Ooh, I got some tangles in here. Okay, let me blow dry this. Okay, so clearly my V was lopsided, so now I gotta fill it back in with my pencil. Dang it. Don't be like me, y'all. <laughs> so I'm gonna use my black eyeliner pencil right here. Just kind of fill that back in. Okay, so that looks a little bit better. Now I wanna see how this is gonna take some heat. So I'm pretty sure this is heat safe. Up, it says up to 400, but I'ma go low. When they go high, I'ma stay low. Or whatever Michelle Obama said. <laughs> okay, so I'ma put mine on 320. And while that's heating up, let me go ahead and wrap this down. Okay, is it hot? Let's see. I'ma do a test strand just to make sure. I don't want it to be seen just in case it melts. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's hot enough. Okay. I think, I think it's good. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going. I don't wanna take away the look, I just don't want so many crimps in it. All right, so the hair is pressed out. She looking good, y'all. Ooh, y'all see that hair? <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup real quick, then we'll come back, unwrap her, and finish up this look, okay? Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I am back with my makeup done. I think it looks pretty good too. Let me take this off. I'll take it off. Okay. Acting like I can see. I can't see that. <laughs> 
right, so I'm gonna get my hairline together. I need to use my hair fetish knot eraser, okay? And I'm gonna use this middle color right here. I may mix these two, depends on how this is looking. Let me start in the back. That may be a little bit too light. Yeah, so that's a little bit too light. So I'm gonna use the darker one because I have my cat back there. So I'm gonna use the darker one first and then I think I'm gonna go into the lighter one. Okay, that, that's better. You gotta color correct. Say my lace was too dark, I wouldn't use my normal concealer to color correct my lace. I would use one of the lighter colors to do that. I think I can use a little bit of the light right here. A little bit more of the dark up here in the front, okay? Now I'm gonna use my black eyeliner pencil just to make sure this is colored in the way I want. Now I need to flatten this out on the top, put it on warm and low. I'm gonna use a little bit of my wax stick up here just to make sure she's flat. Cindy Lou and Bonnie, not today. Hold on, my lace was a little ashy over there. All right, I think I wanna put this one behind my ear. I'm using my She Is Bomb Edge Control. Get my edges together. Go ahead and do this like that. Okay, so I think, I think we are done. Okay, I didn't really care for her too much out the pack. Okay, no shade, but she wasn't really giving me the look that I wanted. But now, y'all, this wig is under 30 dollars now a little work goes a long way okay you didn't have to do nothing i did in this video but if you want to give a look and have people second guessing do the work okay do the work y'all so this is how she's looking to the side all right and then this is how she's looking to the back should i do hoops i feel like i should do hoops i mean you can't really see them okay those are cute let's do those ones so this is what we got y'all i will say the only Mmm, it's a pet peeve or like a, you know, a preference. The ventilated cap on this is real bumpy. I did make sure it's really flat in the back so it comes down all the way on the back of my dome. It doesn't come all the way down to my sides, but I don't really care for it too because, you know, how I have it styled, it looks just fine for me. But the ventilated cap does make it stretchy in the back so I do feel like it's really comfortable for my big hair girls if you wanna check this one out. However, the ventilated cap is bunchy. Like I can feel the tracks under here. You can't see them though, so you know, that's good. So when your man trying to be all cute and trying to touch your hair, Listen, <laughs> just tell him it's your cornrows, okay? Play him. <laughs> I didn't show y'all the card, but like I said, this is the Annie Bob in 12 inches. I got it in the color 1B, and this unit does retail under $30. I will put my Amazon link for this week down below, so if you guys wanna check it out on Amazon, you definitely can. If you have this one, if you have it in a specialty color, chocolate swirl, ginger brown, yeah, they're cute. Okay, so if you wanna check it out in any special colors, you can definitely do that. But let me know down below what you think about this unit. As always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also, smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.